In this video, I'll show you how to use our new templates that are designed specifically for darkroom booth users. Um, the first thing you do is uh, make the purchase at the uh, Photo Booth Owners Design Shop. From there, you will get uh, zip files to download. So I've got a few of them here on my desktop. And uh, the first thing we'll want to do is open up our darkroom booth uh, folder. They refer to it a lot of times. I think it's as, as the X drive. Um, it's usually located in uh, documents and then under darkroom booth and then photos. And in particular, we're going to be interested in the booth templates. So we'll go on in there. Um, to get started, I'm going to go ahead and open up this template, which is, uh, I believe, photo strips. And all we have to do for a darkroom booth um, is to highlight these two, the fo one folder in this file, drag and drop them into this directory. Add that in there. So, and then from there we can go to our darkroom booth, go to choose, and we now have our new thing, which is striped elegance in this particular one. And we want to make sure that we choose the right type of. Uh, layout here so we've got a four photo landscape so just to kind of show you how that is real quickly um, you can go in then from there and you can edit and you can add in um, any of your text layers um, we also uh, I'll show you this way so you can add your text here doing everything normal um, as you can see I don't really know what what the design actually called for so that would probably be kind of helpful so what we can do is is we've uh, rebuilt our packages when we began to integrate with darkroom booth and I'm just gonna go inside of the folder that we uh, pulled out of the package and I'm gonna double click on readme.html it's gonna bring me up information about this and most importantly it's going to tell me all the fonts and give me links to where I can go download these fonts from. So I know that I need Palace Script MT. I've already got it in, on my system. I can actually come here. I've got a lot of fonts. And I can go, there we go. Grab Palace Script MT. Maybe even uh, bump up that so that it looks just like what we had here in the uh, design. I could also go into uh, Photoshop if I still wanted to and I could do it there and then just export out the assets. So um, that's how easy it is actually to use our new templates for Darkroom Booth. If you have any questions, um, please feel free to ask us on the Photo Booth Owners Forums. Um, you can get there quickly at photobooth.forums.com. Thank you.